how did the relationship happen with uh, Rich Homie Corner? Seems like y'all have like a yeah. good relationship. See, like I say, my boy was like, uh, Quan was getting ready to drop an album. Yeah. So I'm like, damn, bitch, I wonder if I could um, play some shit with Rich Homie. You feel me? So I made a couple records. Uh, fuck Quan. I made a couple records for him. It's like, bro, God, bro, like, G Homeboy end up being cool with Quan. And we end up being in the studio. Yeah. And G, like, man, I got a little nigga psycho, bitch, you feel me? And, hey, you'll go good on this record. Mind you, Quan had already heard the record from Dog, who was trying to get the shit placed to him. Yeah. Boom, we get in the studio. G called me one day, he like, yeah, man, Quan in Miami, what you want to do? I'm like, shit, all right, bitch, I'm coming. You feel me? Because I feel like if I get in the room with anybody, I don't care who it is, I get in the room with Drake, nigga, we going to put we gonna put that work. You feel me? That's how I be feeling. I shoot down there. Like, bitch, Quan, like, I play through the records. I'm like, bitch, which one you want to get on? He like, man, this one it. This one it, trust me. So boom, he get on it. We exchange uh, phone numbers and shit. We keep the link, he, he get on the shit. So I'm like, bet <clears throat> the song out. I'm trying to shoot the video. This, I'm like, man, I'm talking about bro. It took us like six months to get a hold of this homie to, just to shoot the video. Man, I, I went to Atlanta. He ended up having a baby on the day we were supposed to shoot the, the video. I'm like, damn, man. So now I'm like reaching out. I'm like, Quan, what's good? You know, man, I'm trying to whoop the whoop. And his management like took a liking to me and Quan, Quan dad, yeah. like fuck with me heavy. So, you know, that was the bonus. They like, man, trust me, man. Quan gonna shoot it. He, he fucking with the record. He fuck with y'all, y'all vibe, whoop the whoop. So bet we finally get Quan to shoot the video. We shoot it in Miami. We shoot it with uh, John J. Visual. And he like, yeah, you know, we kicking it. He like, yeah, bro, I fuck with you like heavy. He like, bro, you feel me? I told you I'm a man of my word. I was going to shoot the video or whatnot. I'm like, yeah, bet, bitch. I really appreciate it. I told him, like, man, I ain't going to lie. I had felt like, bitch, you was flagging me. Like, bitch, it wasn't, wasn't going to happen, you know? He was like, nah, bro, it ain't nothing like that. So me and Quan just always kept in contact. Me and his dad, Corey, Monte. We, we keep in contact and like we just built the relationship off that. Like I done been with Quan numerous amount of times and ain't record not one song. You feel me? Just like on some chill shit. You feel me? It was it was like we just clicked, bro. You feel me? So then it was like we started recording. You feel me? He'll send me music before he dropped. Like we'll just, you know, I send him music. You know, he'd be like, bro, keep going hard. And then we just like been rocking ever since you know what i'm saying then i had another record and i was gonna put it out he ended up calling me one day like bro i really love this shit i'm gonna put this shit on my shit you know what i'm saying on like album. yeah on his album and he ended up keeping the record me and beto made the beat yeah. he ended up keeping it he like yeah bro you feel me but i told you we rocking you know what i'm saying so yeah so bitch i follow bro even to this day oh.